a great Monday morning, folks. Um, this is Marvin here. I'm ready to get this Monday started. Um, so these are a few orders here that I have that sold. Um, these sold actually last night. That's one great thing I love about eBay is that you can actually make money in your sleep. Because uh, stuff that sells 24 hours a day, seven days a week, your store is open. Anyhow, so I got these labels that sold at the bottom. Uh, Dymo lab labels. There's actually two boxes that sold. I had a bunch of these. They were slow movers. These are the last two that I had of them. And I paid around $4.50 for each box. And each box sold for $10. So free shipping. So the two together is $20. Um, it be and it's free shipping on that. Not much money in that, but every reseller knows how important a sale is, as long as you're making some kind of a profit. Next is this train set. It's not the complete set. It's just the trains themselves. They're smaller trains. Um, that's how I found them in the thrift store. I paid thirteen dollars for the set of them. Um, so I sold them all together. For $39.99. And actually I had more on these items. But these are items I had. A, I ran another sale this weekend. So these are items that sold. Some of the items that sold um, during the sale. And then the next I had was this Rap Master. It's the dispenser um, for foil. And so I paid $3 for it. And it sold for $27.99. Again, that was on sale. I ran a 20% discount this weekend. Trying to close a year out. I'm as strong as possible and hit try to get close to my target goal as I could for the year, which my target goal was a hundred thousand in gross sales. I do have one return request here. This item didn't sell for that much. Um, the person said they just didn't like it, there was nothing wrong with it. And I do have free returns, um, and so they can return it and I will pay for the return with no problem. Okay. So that's that much I got going on right now. And let me get started with some other areas. Okay, so these are the packages that I packed over the weekend. Um, it's a total of 10 packages. Uh, most of them are going, all the big boxes are going FedEx. And one thing I try to do, um, if I get going in one direction, if most, most of my orders, the big orders are going UPS, I try to make them all go UPS. Even if I have to pay a dollar more or something like that, just to save myself from going to FedEx. But this time, it's just the opposite. I started off with, <clears throat> excuse me, with orders going to FedEx. So I just kept going in that direction. There's a couple orders in here that I did pay, like maybe a dollar or a dollar something more. Um, just to keep them all going FedEx so I can go to one stop and drop them all off um, and stuff like that. And I do got some going to the post office as well on this bag. Uh, just a few orders in there going to the post office as well. So I'm gonna add, I'm gonna pack the other three orders that I sold, add them to this, and whatever else sells before I make my run, then I'll just take them on with me and get them out the way. Okay, so I'm going to now on a login. Um, I'm going to log in my receipts from yesterday. I did do some sourcing yesterday. Um, my favorite chain of thrift stores, um, they run 25% off every Sunday. All you got to do is show them um, the little, um, on, their, on their little app, you show them the symbol and that you that you are a VIP customer and you get 25% off your total order. And so I'm going to enter an amount. Um, I spent $105.07 yesterday uh, with them. So I log that in. And for that, I just put thrift. And then I put it up on the inventory brought. And of course, that was yesterday. Let me see. 26. And I'm going to take a photo. And that's pretty much it on that. And this is save that and so forth. And that way I have my receipts logged in. And let me get ready to go on to the next task. Okay, so now I'm going ahead to my garage and pull the orders 
uh, that I have out here. I have another item just sold. It's a v VCR um, player. And they do still sell. Uh, I think I sold this one for like 60 bucks. So I'm looking for G1 and G3. There goes G1. This is the foil dispenser. Okay, got that one. And G3. I'm gonna get these crates better organized. I'm gonna have them like in order, like G1, 3, 2, 3, um, or whatever. How I might even number them different later on. So that way I have everything together. Um, and believe me, I don't have it worse before. But you know, this is crazy. See this 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 is what I'm talking about right here. I got the crate's label and I can't even find the crate I'm looking for. G3. I don't I don't remember a G3. You know what? I think it's way down at the bottom down here. Yep. There it is. Alright. See, some of these crates I don't go into that often. But the thing about it is over time. Over time, stuff do sell. So a lot of times I'll be like, man, I forgot I had it, Adam. And, and, but it'd be out of sight, out of mind, and eventually it do sell. All right, let me get these orders in there and get them packed and go on to the next task. Okay, so I'm getting ready to pack right now. These are the labels. Uh, I'm going to pack them together. And I always check to make sure that I, had, I took the price off the box. And make sure there's no prices, nothing like that on the box. Uh, stuff like that. These are the other three orders over here. This is what I have just sold. Uh, this VCR right here. And stuff like that. So, like I said, they do sell. This is a shop brand. This is a regular old VCR. And uh, it sold for $55. Free shipping. I paid $5 for it and so forth. So, let me go and get these items packed. And I'm going to put this on. I'm going to put this on hyper speed so y'all can get this out the way real quick. All right. So as you can see, my piles is expanding a little bit more. I added about four more packages. Now I grab me a little snack. Let me see. Mm. What do I want? Let's see. I'll drink my apple cider later on. So I think right now, I'll give me one of my organic energies. And then I grab me a little snack here. My wife don't like me eating these, these things. They got like, um, Something generic, or, um, something she said that she doesn't like in there, so like that. But anyhow, I'll snack on this. They got peanut raisins, um, little MM things in there, and everything. I do got butter, better snacks that PR Poppy can snack on. I keep cashews, peanuts, and stuff like that up in there. I got some healthy other bars too, grain free, all that stuff like that. But for some reason, I keep gravitating towards these. So let me go on and do my next task. Open some blinds here, let some light in here. Oh yeah, beautiful day down here in Dallas. Of course I'm in DeSoto. Suburb of Dallas, but it's beautiful. So now what I'm gonna do now, see all I'm gonna do right now is just, I'm gonna start entering in uh, from the items I just packed. Um, I gotta add up what they came up to, now enter into my gold daddy bookkeeping account on my desktop here. And so um I'll do that real quick. 
and then go on to my next task after I finish this. Okay, so here you're seeing my payout so far. Um, this has come over from the week on the 26th. That was Sunday. Uh, eBay has recently here started sending out payouts over the weekend before they weren't. Like before, like if I got a payout on Friday, uh, it were in process um, until um, that Monday. So now they, they it basically processes through the weekend, but it won't land to your bank account. eBay processes it, but it won't land to your bank account until like either Monday or Tuesday. So this one that was processed yesterday, the one seventy four eighty six. And then today, this morning, I had three twenty six forty three. So both together, a little bit over five hundred dollars. The eBay process, and that will land into my bank account tomorrow morning. And so that'll be my first payout for the week. Is a little bit over five hundred dollars. And so now my goal is to just keep selling as much as possible to build up another good payday as I go throughout the week. Have several more paydays. All right, let me get some loss started here. Okay, so I got that much out of the way this morning. About the first hour of waking up, as, um, as I start my Monday off this Monday, it's not always the same way. Uh, since I'm, like tomorrow morning, I'll be starting out um, probably either maybe packing orders if need be, but mainly I'll be getting out sourcing tomorrow. And so, so today, and sometimes it's not like sometimes Mondays I'll be out sourcing. It depends on how you know what I did the day before. Anyhow, so right now I'm going to answer. I'm gonna to respond to a feedback, and then um, uh, and, and then I I got some stuff I hit the post in the garage, so I can do that. But the main thing I wanted to get done today, as far as my eBay business, also is to pick up some supplies, packing supplies. Um, one to go to Walmart, pick up some more boxes. Uh, this one size I I don't have is the larger boxes that I ship most of my like VCRs, DVD players, stereo equipment and stuff like that with larger speakers and so forth. And then also I need to pick up some bubble wrap because I'm low on bubble wrap. And so I need to pick up some more to last me two to three weeks on out from today on through the new year and stuff like that. So I get that done today. Not no real, real busy day um, and stuff like that, but I do have to get some stuff posted anywhere. I'm gonna try to get about 10 items posted or more and stuff like that, and it's very, it helps your business a lot, your eBay business, uh, to as much as you can to post on a consistent basis. Um, I don't post every day. I would like to, but I don't post every day. But I post enough to sell continuously um, with my stores being looked at and so forth like that, and I can get some sales. Okay, folks, so that's about it. I want to get my rest of my day started, and I'll talk to y'all later.